Hey guys, what's up? The Weapon here bringing you a brand new episode of NBA 2K22 My Career Mode. In today's episode, we're versing the Indiana Pacers and then we should get an interview with Andrew Torres to talk about our fashion. So if you guys do enjoy this episode, hit that like button. Let's get three likes on this episode and let's get stuck into the game. A different rule. Bruh. Oh my god, look at him jump! Ooh. Easy dunk on the little fella as well. Nice work. Bruh. Get blocked! Oof. We were lucky to block him there. We did fall for the first pump fake. Bruh. Oh! Wait, I got the steal? What? Okay, I'll take the steal. Finish it, Joseph. Easy assist. Oh, get past him. That is too easy. Come on, Turner. Gotta be better than that, mate. Get blocked! There we go. They're still in zero points. In like the first six minutes. Good momentum. 14 straight now. Oh, the crossover Ooh. move and the dunk. So far, they're only up the court. Come the Go, Joseph, what? shoot that three. Yeah, that's my second assist. Joseph Easy. Here's Get blocked. Why would you challenge that, mate? Oh, the another block. We are really dominating this quarter. Two on the clock. Another block. Oh, Easy. Bruh. Allow it to be a little more entertaining. Oh. Bruh. I wanted to pass the Joseph. He was wide open in the three in the corner. Come on, get past him. You know, we can shoot Bruh. this. There we go. There's the foul. And there's the end one. Lovely work. Nice. Oh, let's go. In the post. Here we go. This should be pretty easy work. How do I not get that? Come on, man. Shoot that again. There we go. And there's the double double as well with that offensive rebound. Oh, this is an easy dunk. Hey, that's pretty good. Get past him. There we go. That's just too easy. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, beauty. Oh, where is the absolute pressure? Oh wow! Get out of my way! Yeah, pass that ball. Ooh. Lovely play. Easy. Oh, come on, man! Nice. Go, Jackson! Shoot that! Nice shot. Nice block. Easy. And good win. Very, very good win. Winning by, I think it's uh, 46 points. Terrific effort right there. Let's continue on. Andrew, what's going on? It's early in your career, but it seems like you've developed into a much better player while you've been in the league. <laughs> Thanks for noticing. Is there a part of your game you're most proud of? Hmm. The way I'm able to... Mm, probably... Mm, probably my decision-making. Probably my decision making. You know, I've really been able to learn from experience to now make much better choices within the flow of the game. And that's carrying over off the court too. Look, I've been talking to an amazing clothing designer named Sasha about working together. Could be the best decision of my life. You wanna take it back to clothes? We can take it back to clothes. <laughs> what do you like about Sasha's designs? Um, hmm. Her work is exciting because it feels something, or it feels something familiar. But while also, yeah, I've did this one. You know, did this. Just do that one. I couldn't read it quickly. Clear that what she is matches everything that I am. It just it it lines up nicely to what we're trying to do. You can't work with someone if you don't have a foundation in common. You know, her work is exciting because it it, it feels like something familiar while also being just completely new. Mm, interesting combination. Thanks. Um, hmm. You don't want to go for ladies first. All right, let's go to Candace next. So I'm working on a piece on the concept of defensive awareness and new techniques that are being developed to coach defensive awareness. Something that's traditionally looked at as more of an innate ability. Uh, you showed great defensive awareness tonight, as usual. So I'm, I'm just wondering how you developed that part of your game. Hmm, good question. Um, you gotta love this game. Live this game. You know, that's, that's just being a hooper. You got to love this game. Live for this game. And for me, I don't think there's any replacement for in-game reps. That's the whole point. Play the game. Learn the game. 
and it's thousands of hours to build up to that kind of thing. I'm not sure wearing a VR helmet or whatever Steph's doing these days is where it's at, but hey. Oh, so you're not big on training technologies then? Hey, whatever floats your boat, but I'm a little bit more old school in the sense that it's all about playing the game to me. You practice drills, guess what? You get better at drills, and if you want to get better at playing, guess what? You play the game. That's just how I see it anyway, so. Anyway, good team win, 46 points, 30, um, 46 point win, should I say, 30 points, uh, we got 13 rebounds, 3 assists, 1 steal, 8 blocks, A plus teammate grade, I'll take that game, really good defensive effort right there, almost got a new badge, but we should get a couple of new badges next game, let's continue on. Overall, another great game from us, 30 points, 8 blocks, really good work, and even the rebounds as well. We're getting consistent double-doubles. Now we're going to get working on getting consistent triple-doubles. But anyway, I'm going to end off the episode here. Thank you so much for watching this episode. I really do appreciate it. I'd appreciate it even more if you guys could hit that like and subscribe button so it could spread to viewers across the globe. And please, make sure you check out my Sunset Overdrive series on your screen right now. Great game. I recommend this game so much because it's hilarious. Its story is phenomenal. Check it out. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.